Okay, hello everyone. This is Victor Momo from Excel Moments. In this video, I want to talk about fill across worksheets. Something you may or may not have stumbled on in your Excel journey. Let me show you where it is. On the home tab, if you go to the editing group, you would see fill. We typically, you know, can do fill down, fill right, or you have fill across worksheets. Okay, it's grayed out. So for curious cats like myself, I wonder, like, hmm. So when do I use this and why is it grayed out? Okay, so you are filling across worksheets. As long as you have one worksheet selected, that button is going to remain grayed out. So let me just select another sheet in addition. So I will hold control and just click maybe the second sheet. And you notice that when you go there now, field, you can see across worksheets is what active and enabled so it means it's a feature that can be used when you have more than one sheet selected so now let me show you this scenario i have this data which just shows maybe location visitors and sales from january to december if you look at january it's properly formatted well in my opinion <laughs> but when you look at you know my data for the other months it's just bland right things are out of place alignment is off no borders you know no formatting and that's the same thing i'm just going to do control page down to go through some of the others right so you see the only thing that's changing are the numbers but the formatting is off but I already have January properly formatted, okay? So do I go, you know, from worksheet to worksheet, um, actually changing the format, making things bold? No, I don't need to do that. What I can do is I can feel this formatting across the other worksheets, okay? So I'm just going to use that feature. You can still do this with, you know, like a copy-paste special once you can select all sheets, but I just thought to show you we feel across worksheets, okay? So you select January, which is where I have the formatting. Now I'm going to select everything all the way to December. How do I do that? I hold my shift and I click the last uh, worksheet tab here, which is December. And all of them are selected. Okay. I then select the data, right? And I would then say fill across worksheets. So I'm going to go to fill and I will say across worksheets. It's going to ask me a question. Do you want to fill the contents or the formats? Because every month you know have their own data so i'm not going to fill the content i'm just going to fill the format so i'm going to select what formats and i do okay right so now i can ungroup sheets just to see what's going on all right so this is february you can see that february this has you know the formatting and you know and so on so that's how you use the fill across worksheet so it's like just taking you know formatting and then uh, moving it across, you know, a lot of other sheets. So even if there are 50, 60, I don't know why it seems like 50 worksheets, you know, you can just um, apply the same formatting with a few clicks. That's it. If you've never used fill across worksheets, well, you just did. So if you like this video, hit the like button. You could also subscribe to the channel, Excel Moments. But for now, I'm out.